Hello, everybody. Happy Thanksgiving. I have been gone for about two weeks, but now I'm back. So today, instead of all the heavy, heavy foods that I'm sure y'all are pretty tired of, I'm going to be making a Zeppa Toscana soup. So follow along. So I'm going to add a thick cut of bacon in. I, I just cut it into one inch squares. So all we're going to do is just cook this on medium low. We don't want to like cook it really, really like fast. We just want to like show it some love, you know. I, I find when it cooks too fast that it gets really like brittle and hard. I kind of want it to be more tender, okay? Because because this is going to go on top, all right? So follow along. Okay, so my bacon is almost done. Rendering down. Looks really good. It's not too overdone. What I'm going to do now is just take it out. We're going to take out about two tablespoons of, of uh, grease. We're going to drop in onions and uh, fennel. Okay. So this is a half of a cup of onion. Yellow onion. We're going to drop in um, a little bit of salt. Lots of pepper. Oh my goodness. That smells so good. It just, just the scent is just amazing. So we're gonna give this a stir. Look at that. Yum, yum, yum. Okay, now we're gonna add in about five cloves of garlic. And I know it, it's a lot, but it really does need it. Let that get some mm, mm, mm. Oh my goodness. That just smells so good. So amazing. Okay, now I'm going to add in about a pound of mild Italian sausage. Okay? That way the onions don't burn, the garlic doesn't burn, and it's gonna, it's gonna be yummy. Okay, here we go. Wash my okay, now it's uh, time for some fresh, fresh thyme. <laughs> Get it? Fresh thyme. Almost done. So just kind of give it a chop. So now to this, we're going to add in about five cups of broth. You can use chicken, vegetable, but today I'm going to use chicken broth, okay? There we go. Now what we're going to do is we're going to make sure everything's up and off the uh, the actual bottom. Get everything up and off the bottom. Kind of give the bottom of the pan a little bit of a scrape. Because that's where all the yum yums are, you know. And we got to have that. That's where everything is. It smells good. Okay, so now we're gonna cover this up, and this is gonna go for, for about 20 minutes on low. Okay, so now what I did was was I I got some uh, kale. I actually took the leaves off of the stems, and now what I'm gonna do is just give it just a rough chop. Okay. And this is going to go in very last. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut up about four good sized. I like white, so this is what I'm going to use. So all I do is just cut it in half. This is what I do. I just give it another dice. Okay. And then I just kind of do little bite sized. See what I mean? 
just like that. Okay, so now we're gonna add in our potatoes. Gently lay them in. Give it a stir. Look at that. That looks so yummy. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. Let this go for about 10 minutes in the give it a check, but it should be done about 12 minutes, okay? Okay, so now let's give it a uh, taste. What does it need? It's really, really uh, hot. Oh, wow, that's really, really good. Okay, so to this we're going to add in a cup of heavy cream. Let's give it a shake. <clears throat> just right on top okay this is gonna cook down for five minutes and it's done all right okay so now we're done what we're gonna do is we're gonna top this with some bacon okay a little bit of bacon okay and then we're gonna shave some Parmesan on top Top that with some chives and some uh, fennel fronds. Okay. A little hit of black pepper. And that's it. Okay, so now my niece is here and she's going to give me a taste test. So go ahead. Take a bite, it's very hot though. <laughs> I'm hungry. Mmm. Does it does it taste just like um olive garden? That has a really good flavor. The mm -hmm. bacon adds a bit of a crunch. Mm-hmm. That's good. But better than Olive Garden? Oh, yeah, for sure. That's all I wanted to hear. Okay, guys, it's done. Thank you so much. And uh, I'll be back. Have a blessed night. Okay, so now we're going to add in our potatoes. Ah, kind of. Ow! That got me. Gently lay them in, unlike me.